To mount Helicon FB tube, align the mounting index marks on the tube and the camera body and then turn the tube counterclockwise until it click locks. Then attach the lens as usual. Helicon FB tube can also be combined with other extension tubes. Once you turn the camera on, you should see the tube flash green. Now you need to adjust the camera and the lens setting as described in the table on the configuration page. Helicon FB2 for Nikon cameras allows manual focusing only. Set the camera focusing mode to manual. The switch on the lens to autofocus position. Now enable burst shooting by setting the wheel to the continuous high speed position. Now the camera and the lens are set up for shooting with the tube. Even at default, you can focus manually on the nearest focusing point, press and hold down the shutter button, and you will see the lens shifting focus by an equal step at each shot. Now you need to configure the tube, i.e. to set the correct step for your lens and aperture. Install the configuration utility available for Android, iOS, Windows, and Mac OS. In the configuration utility, choose the camera type, the lens, the correct aperture, preferred shooting direction, and tap the proceed button. Insert the transmitter in the 3.5 mm audio input. or use extension cable for convenience. Now turn on the live view mode. Bring the transmitter close to the receiver on the tube, making sure you didn't misrecognize it with the LED light. Tap send in the app and watch the LED on the tube flash green. The configuration is over once it stops flashing and goes out. Now the new settings have been set and the tube is ready for shooting. Now set the focus manually on the initial shooting point and press and hold down the shutter button to shoot series.